United ISD is proposing a school bond for $408.7 million to keep up with the continuing growth that UISD is experiencing. Over the last decade, United ISD has seen more than 10,000 new students enroll, and it's anticipated that in the next five years the district will need to make room for an additional 4,000 students. United School Bond 2013 will address the need for new schools to manage the continuing growth, as well as the need to improve our existing campuses. The proposal includes a plan to build 14 new schools, seven elementary schools, three middle schools, and four ninth grade campuses. In addition to new schools, the bond proposal funds additions and renovations to several of our oldest campuses, as well as the installation of technology and safety and security upgrades at all UISD campuses. The United School Bond proposition will be one of the proposals UISD voters will see on this November's ballot. If you'd like more information about the UISD bond, go to our website at www.uisd.net. Early voting runs from October 21st to November 1st, and Election Day is November 5th. Gear Up is a program that grooms middle school students to attend a university. The Gear Up program at Texas A&M International University set up shop at Alexander High School last summer. We get to see how the experience encourages students to continue their education after high school. As we're bringing in the opportunities for students, we are providing uh, algebra, algebra one, we're providing geometry, we're multimedia, and journalism to approximately over 200 students. And again, what we want to do with these uh, students here is provide them the opportunity to be able to be academically ready in this transition from eighth grade to ninth grade. The purpose of um, this class is to give students a foundation of biology so that when they enter their freshman year, Come August, they'll be better prepared. They would have a background, a solid foundation as to what biology is. And I start with the biomolecules, which are the phospholipids, um, the lipids, the proteins, the nucleic acids, and carbohydrates, because they make up the components of the main components of the cell. And of course, that is biology. We're giving the students the the knowledge as to an understanding as to why is it important to come in in the summertime and take advantage of the program. Teachers at United ISD are taking part in the Abydos writing program. The intensive program shows teachers how to effectively teach students to write. As part of their training, the teachers collected their written assignments and had them published. It's a 12-day program and it's a writing intensive program for elementary, middle school and high school teachers. It has allowed us to get in touch or to facilitate, to help us to become better writers as teachers, therefore becoming better models and making the writing genuine in the classroom. It made me a better writer, it made me a, a better prepared for my students and I think that this is a good training like for everybody for district-wide that, um, that we should be go through this training because it really does help us go back to the classroom and implement all these strategies for our students. Students at Cuellar Elementary are being taught about leadership. They are learning Stephen Covey's seven habits of highly effective people. The school held an assembly and invited Congressman Henry Cuellar. The congressman spoke to students about leadership showing them how to be leaders and this is so important because we you know this will be the leaders of the innovation the creativity the entrepreneurs and the future political leaders uh, some of the uh, leaders that we'll see they'll go into education they'll go into the medicine they'll go into the uh, education the health care different areas and it's important to know that leaders start at this age you don't just one day graduate in college and say I'm a leader you start teaching the basic traits of a leader those traits include poise and confidence. Students are being introduced to Covey's seven principles. Be proactive, begin with the end in mind, put first things first, think win-win, seek first to understand, then to be understood, synergize, and sharpen the saw.